Hello guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to remove a watermark from a video for free. It's going to be super useful and by the end of this video you'll know exactly how to do it using multiple methods. Also, make sure to check the video description for the full breakdown and helpful links. So let's get started. First, open any web browser such as Chrome, Firefox or Edge. In the search bar type media.io and press enter. Alternatively, you can directly go to the URL by typing https colon slash slash www.media.io. Once you're on the media.io homepage, wait for the page to fully load. Look at the top right corner of the page. You'll see the option to log in. Click on it. Now enter your registered email address and password, or you can log in using a Google or Facebook account for quicker access. If you don't already have an account, you can easily sign up for free in just a few seconds. Once you're logged in, scroll down the homepage until you find the section that says watermark remover or something similar. Click on the button that says remove watermark. Now to open the tool, this will redirect you to the watermark removal interface where you can start uploading your video. In the center of the screen, you will see a message like double click here to upload your video. Go ahead and double click on that area. A file explorer window will pop up, browse your computer or device, and select the video that contains the watermark you want to remove. Once you've selected the video, click open or OK to upload it to the media.io platform. On the right hand side of the screen, you'll notice a panel where you can adjust the brush size. This tool lets you control how precise your watermark selection is. Move your cursor over to the video preview window. Using the brush tool, highlight the watermark you want to remove by clicking and dragging over it. Make sure you accurately cover the entire watermark area. If necessary, zoom in to fine tune your selection. After selecting the area, look at the bottom right corner of the screen. Click the button that says remove object now or remove watermark. The platform will now begin processing the video. This may take a few moments depending on the video length and the complexity of the watermark. Once the processing is complete, the watermark will be removed from your video. You'll see a preview or a message confirming the removal. Now click the download button to save the edited video to your device. Choose the desired resolution or format if prompted and wait for the download to complete. And that's it. As you can see, the video is now downloaded without the watermark. You can now use it for your presentations, social media, or other projects without any distracting logos or marks. This method is quick, easy, and effective. Now let's try the second method for removing watermarks from a video. First, open Google Chrome or any browser you prefer, and in the search bar type 123 apps and press enter. From the search results, look for the official website which should be something like 123apps.com, and click to open it. Once the website is loaded, take a moment to explore the tools offered. Among the options available, look for the one that says remove logo from video or something similar. This is the tool we'll be using to remove the watermark. Go ahead and click on that option. After the tool loads, you'll see a button that says open file. Click on that and a file selection window will appear. From here, browse through your folders and select the video file that contains the watermark you want to get rid of you'll see a preview of your video on the screen. Now move your cursor over the video area and simply click and drag to select the part of the screen where the watermark or logo is located. This creates a box over the watermark, telling the tool which part to clean up. As you can see, the tool starts to remove the watermark almost instantly. It works by covering up or blurring out the selected area from the video so that the logo or watermark is no longer visible. Adjust the selection box as needed to make sure it covers the watermark completely. After you're satisfied with the result, go over to the left-hand side of the screen and click the export button. This tells the platform to start processing your video with the watermark removed. Give it a moment to complete the process. This depends on your video length and the changes made. Once it's done, the video will automatically start downloading to your device. And you're done. That's all it takes. You've successfully removed a watermark from your video using 123 apps quickly and easily without installing any extra software. Now move on to the third method for removing watermarks from videos and this one is also super simple. First, open Google and search for B-Cut. From the search results, 
find the official BCUT website, usually something like bcut.com, and click to open it. Once the website loads, look around for the option that says edit online and click on it. This will take you to their online video editing tools. Next, click the option that says remove watermark. This is the tool you'll be using. Then, look for the button labeled remove watermark from video and go ahead and click it. You'll be asked to upload your file. Click the upload button and browse through your computer to select the video file that contains the watermark you want to remove. Once you've selected the video, it will begin uploading. Just wait a few seconds depending on your internet speed and video size. After the video finishes uploading, you'll see it appear in the editor. Now look closely at your video and select the area where the watermark is located. You might see a selection box or a tool to draw over the watermark, use that to precisely mark the spot. Once you're done marking the area, click the Erase button. The tool will start processing your video and begin removing the watermark from the selected portion. It might take a moment to complete. Once the process finishes, you'll see the watermark removed from your video. Now click on Download Files to save the edited video to your computer. And that's it. Your video is now completely watermark-free thanks to BCut's easy-to-use online tool. Now let's start the fourth method, which uses Adobe Premiere Pro. If you already have it installed, go ahead and launch Premiere Pro on your computer. Once it opens, start a new project, or open an existing one, and import your video file by dragging it into the project media panel. Then, drag the video down into the timeline so you can begin editing. Next, go over to the effects panel, usually located on the right side of your screen. In the search bar, type blur, and from the search results, find Gaussian blur under the video effects category. Click and drag the Gaussian blur effect onto your video clip in the timeline. Now select the video clip you just applied the blur to, then go to the effect controls panel at the top left. Under Gaussian blur, you'll find a tool called the mask pen tool. Click on it, and now go to your video preview window. Use the pen tool to draw a mask around the watermark. This selects only the watermark area to apply the blur. Once the mask is in place, go back to the effect controls panel and increase the blur amount. The higher the blur, the more hidden the watermark becomes. Keep adjusting until the watermark is no longer visible. This technique works best for static or corner placed watermarks, and that's it. You've successfully removed the watermark using Premiere Pro. Now let's move on to the fifth method, which is done using CapCut for PC. First, open the CapCut app on your computer. Once it's open, create a new project and import your video by dragging it into the media library and placing it on the timeline. Next, right-click on the video clip in the timeline and select Duplicate. This creates a copy of your video and places it directly above the original clip in the timeline. Now with two identical video layers stacked, we'll apply the blur effect to the top video. Go to the Effects tab and in the search bar, type Blur. Choose one of the blur effects available, like Basic Blur or Gaussian Blur, and apply it to the top video layer. You might need to apply the blur multiple times for a stronger effect, depending on how visible the watermark is. After that, look to the right-hand panel and find the mask option. Click on it, then choose rectangle as your mask shape. Now take the mask box and position it directly over the watermark. You can resize and move the rectangle to perfectly fit the watermark's location. By masking the blurred video layer only over the watermark area, it hides the watermark using a soft blur while keeping the rest of your video sharp and unaffected. The watermark now blends into the background and is practically invisible. And just like that, you're done. CapCut gives you a simple and effective way to remove or cover watermarks without needing advanced editing skills. If you found this helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss more awesome tips and tutorials.